what's up guys in this video we'll be looking at lucx price update real quick as you can see the price of lucx is down minus 8.6 percent and um, we also have some news around the lucs space we're going to be discussing in this video and also we'll be looking at the price chart for lucs on the daily time frame looking at some important level to take note of also the btc dominance we'll be looking at the chart and a um, couple of charts important chart to ascertain um the level we should expect lucx to move to as you can see they posted on their twitter page um updated on their twitter page four hours ago and uh, if you're looking at this candle for lucx you will notice we dropped sharply a couple of hours ago and um the the deep got eaten by wise investors and the price is now back up at around 0 0.0893 and uh, we dropped sharply to around 0 0.075 and um yeah so I don't see LUCS losing this support area anytime soon. Honestly, that's just the truth. And if we should lose this support area we bounce from, we should consolidate for a very long time at around this um, um, green uh, rectangular area at around 0 0.0, at around 6 cents and also 5 cents for LUCX. And um, the truth of the matter is the bottom is in for LUCX already. I don't see LUCS going below um, that anytime soon. So they said to achieve growth it is important to focus on the writing and sometimes that means letting go of futures that nobody uses we announced a month ago that um, we are closing the sub product the lucx terminal and um, they initially have a sub um, uh, aspect in the lucx um, platform called the lucx terminal where you can see trending um, project and also do a lot of stuff with it and um, the ceo also retweeted it he said the focus is key Okay, he said focus is a key principle um, that guides successful startup. To achieve great, it is important to focus on the right thing and sometimes that means letting go of the small features that nobody uses and double down on where we see most growth and demand at LOCX, you understand? And um, he also replied somebody that was trying to fault um, the news. He said wrong. It is about focusing resources and build things people love demand for lucx terminal has been declining over the last 24 months people do not want to spread their funds across many crypto exchanges but rather want reliable trusted and regulated platforms like lucx as um some of you already know lucx exchange is one of the top-notch exchange out there they are regulated and um they are getting to tier one exchange very soon let's just check the um some fundamentals and sentimentals out real quick on on um coin market cap so the price of lucs is currently at around 0 0.08855 and the price is down minus 8.7 percent in the last 24 hours okay the truth of the matter is now lucs is a very very undervalued um crypto exchange and also the token the lucx token is a very 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 undervalued um, um um project you understand considering the very low total supply and maximum supply which is less than a billion lucx token and also considering the market cap which is less than 100 million dollars the market cap is already sitting at 68 million dollars this project can easily get to 10 dollars in the coming bull market cycle you never can tell anything can happen you can even surpass that by the time the exchange starts growing bigger and bigger bigger you should expect the value of the token to also skyrocket that's the truth and if this lucx um project is to get to uh is to get to ten dollars per token ten dollars per token if it's to get to ten dollars per token we should expect a market cap of around seven billion dollars and also that should give anybody that is invested let's assume you threw in one thousand dollars now at this current price we should expect at um a return on investment around 111 okay yeah 111 x of your return on investment um your one thousand dollars should turn into around hundred and something over hundred thousand dollars you understand that's the potential this project have if you are investing think long term think long term like seriously and um yeah so let's go back to the charts and um this lucs let's just check btc dominant out real quick so btc dominant is currently sitting at around almost 15 
50% is sitting at um, 47.6% for the BTC dominant on the daily time frame. And the reason why the market, the altcoins are not pumping yet is because BTC is out, is outshining them. The dominant is too much. So BTC dominant needs to correct to around 44.44 um, and also um, correct to around 43 for altcoin to have a relief, a little bit of relief rally. And if we, BTC dominant should drop, which we are expecting it to drop massively to around at least 40 percent oh my god then altcoins are likely to perform massively well so we should be expecting btc dominant to drop to around uh 40 percent around 40 percent and also expect the dominance to drop to around uh, 42 uh 40 42 43 respectively for btc dominant for altcoin to have a, a little bit of relief rally you understand so i don't see oh god i i, I just pray the dominant drop asap like seriously because i haven't checked my wallet for weeks now i don't usually check my investment wallet because i'm into the investment for long term so but I know there should be bleeding right now and um, I, I would love to see my altcoins um, holdings in green. You understand? Who doesn't love that? So let's just check BTC on the one hourly time frame. This is the one hour time frame for BTC. And we have a trend line here which BTC has respected several times. So the moment we're coming to this trend line and BTC is breaking it, we, we are expected to bounce from this zone. I gave this zone in my VIP group a couple of... Um, yeah two days ago and we bounced from it when i gave the signal i said we are likely to bounce from here or here you understand so we bounced from here went up came back retested it and then bounced massively to the upside almost six percent you understand for btc so this area is still a very significant area for btc area at around twenty six thousand nine hundred dollars so everyone should keep an eye on that particular price area for btc the moment we're breaking that area then btc is likely to fall to twenty six thousand five hundred and then respectively so let's just check um let's check btc on the daily time frame out real quick so this is btc on the daily time frame i'm expecting the price of btc to um pump a little bit to around close to twenty nine thousand dollars before retracing to twenty five thousand dollars and twenty five thousand dollar support is not that strong to me it's not that significant to me because since we broke that area very um easily i think we are likely to also break down by the time the price corrects to that level you understand and um the moment we're breaking down from that twenty five thousand dollar support for btz we should expect the price to consolidate a, a, for a while at around 23 and then drop to 21 respectively which is a very significant um support area for btc and um yeah so Depending on what the Federal Reserve, the yeah, the Fed uh, meeting on Wednesday is go the outcome. Depending on the outcome, the outcome will determine the direction um, of which BTC will follow. And um, we talked about this um, CME gap. We've talked about this CME gap several times on our channel. We started talking about it when we had uh, a massive gap here. So we got the gap here filled. And uh, we now have the CME gap at around 21,000, between 21 and 20,000 dollar level for BTC. And also, let me just take this line out real quick so that we'll have a clear chart. Okay, so we now have a CME gap at around, uh, we now have a CME gap at around. We now have a CME gap at around twenty-seven thousand dollar for level for BTC and also twenty-six. Uh, yeah, okay. We have a CME gap between twenty-seven and twenty-seven thousand dollars. Yeah, around twenty-seven thousand dollar for BTC, as you can see. That's the gap right here, and also we have another unfilled, yet to get filled CME gap for BTC at around um twenty-one thousand dollar level for btc so i don't intend making this video lengthy and um, as always my name is isaac stay out of trouble invest the amount you can afford to lose peace out